This is meteorologist Todd Shea with the La Crosse National Weather Service with a severe weather briefing updated on Tuesday afternoon, July the 19th. The hazards that we're looking at for this week include a potential heavy rain or flash flood event tonight into Wednesday morning and then the possibility of excessive heat looking ahead towards Thursday and Friday. The heavy rain threat tonight is very conditional uh, but could lead to flash flooding if thunderstorms do uh, impact the area and then again expecting some uh, high heat and humidity come Thursday and Friday. Looking at the heavy rain potential for tonight, there is a flash flood watch out, but again this is a very conditional risk. There is a risk that thunderstorms could form to the west tonight and then slowly progress east into Wisconsin across parts of southern Minnesota and northern Iowa. Uh, but some of the weather data also suggests that thunderstorms could form and move around us leading to no threat at all. But with this risk, looking at how the radar could evolve overnight, it shows how the thunderstorms with some heavy rain progress into Wisconsin by Wednesday morning. The potential rainfall if thunderstorms do form could be in the one to two inch range with locally higher amounts. Uh, but again, this is a lower confidence scenario. There is a chance that thunderstorms could form and move around the region, impacting us very little. As far as other related severe weather like dangerous winds or large hail, that risk is very marginal or a level one out of five. This is the outlook for tonight and into Wednesday, mainly in the area for the potential of a few stronger storms, but mainly heavy rain producers as they progress east. So as far as our thunderstorm risk level, the, the highest of the risks is heavy rainfall with some flooding possible. The other risks relatively low at this time. Looking ahead to Thursday and Friday with the heat, again this is a much higher confidence scenario. Heat related warnings are more likely on Thursday, but slightly cooler temperatures, uh, still hot though, uh, will be in tap on Friday, could allow for mainly advisories. The high temperature forecast on Thursday on the left and the heat index values expected on Thursday show why excessive heat warnings are going to be likely across the area and we certainly urge people to use extreme caution especially if working outdoors on Thursday afternoon. On Friday a slight relief but temperatures will still be in the 90s with some heat indexes approaching 100 or slightly above. So again a heavy rain or flash flood potential tonight into Wednesday morning, uh, but higher confidence of excessive heat come Thursday and Friday across the area. So we would ask you to check our web page, follow us on social media, but basically keep up on the weather this week if you have outdoor plans. You might need to watch out for the possibility of heavy rain over the next 24 to 36 hours with excessive heat later in the week.